Today I'm going to show you how to apply grit to your pickleball paddle and what products to use to apply this grit. So I found this pretty cool product online. It's called Lucid Grip Kit and it's made for applying like grip tape to skateboards. They have uh, three different grit levels. They have a, a light, a medium, and a heavy. I went with the light because I want to match the grit close as I can to a paddle that when you buy it right off the shelf. So this kit comes with a brush to apply the glue. It also comes with the glue and a spray bottle. I tried it the first time in the spray bottle. The website or the, the YouTube video says run water through it to spray it to get it to nice a nice good stream and it just didn't work. So um, I only use it to apply the glue. Um, this is the grit that it comes with. This is the light and then I went to automotive store and grabbed this uh, spray adhesive which works for many different surfaces and it worked out good for uh, the pickleball paddle. Um, so what I did was basically I taped off the, the borders and the grip of this paddle and then you grab the glue and what I did was I took this brush took this lid off and dipped it in the brush and then applied glue nice evenly all around nice coat then I went ahead and took this uh, this grit and then I started just basically like this tapping it nice evenly across the entire board you don't want to be too close when you're applying it because it'll start to It'll be heavy and then drop and then create clumps. So you want it to be a nice good foot distance and then tap. What they suggest is start tapping away from your surface and then bring it over and then start uniforming it. So once you get that on, a nice coat, again I grabbed the Gorilla Spray and just sprayed a nice coat to really get that grit to stay. I actually let it dry and then applied another coat. So here's the finished product. I did both sides, but you can really tell that that grit is going to really get good spin on the ball. When I rub my hand across it, that grit's not coming off on my fingers. It's really staying there. It would have been nice if they had, you know, different colors, but unfortunately they only have clear, so I know this board is black, but you can really so that see that looks real nice. Again, I don't this isn't legal. This is I mean, but again, all these other paddles that have grit on them they lose grit, so I mean, I, I think this is fair game. I'm not in, in any league or anything, so I mean, again, who even I heard that the pros have that the um pickleball manufacturers apply grit for them. So it stays on. I mean, I, I don't know how how they do that, but but they, they, I've read that they do that. And again, who wants to buy a new paddle? These, these paddles, good ones, are up to you know, over $150. You lose your spin rate after a few games. It, this is the way to go. So again, like this is before. And this is after. And it's, I've yet to use it. Um, so I'll update the video once I uh, go ahead and use it let you know how it works. But I also, uh, there's another product that's pretty good, these lizard grips. I applied these to the, all these paddles. You can get it at Dick Sporting Goods, has some, and even Amazon has some in uh, different colors, but really nice, uh, spongy and, and really grippy. So again, this product is Lucid Grip Kit. You can get it on Amazon. You'd, I used the tape to tape around. Again, this is the, the glue with the brush, apply the grit, and then the, to seal it all, apply this spray, Gorilla Glue, glue spray. And that's which final product that's what you're going to get. Hope you like this video. Again, I'll update it with uh, how it performs, but I'm telling you it's going to be lit. All right.